John, to answer your first question, do you think anybody cares? Absolutely not. I said this the other day. We're all hypocrites to a degree. I'm a hypocrite. Include I am one. You're one. Everybody's hypocrite. We all are. Absolutely. And I said this the other day about the birthday shit. Everybody's a fucking hypocrite. And when it comes to money, the streets got to eat. So if he's throwing away money and enable to smack the shit out of his girlfriend, nobody going to care about that. They care about the money. And if, if you're fooling yourself, if you think that the money is not important, you know what I mean? They don't give a shit that he smacked the shit out of her, how proud he was of it. Colleen heard it. I've heard it. Everybody in the space yeah. heard it. You, you, They called Trucker Jeff uh, a woman beater. Well, what the fuck is he? Uh, a woman pleaser? I mean, that's crazy. He's the same exact thing. And nobody cares. <laughs> Only difference between them two well, Trucker Jeff gives out money too, but the only difference is he's giving away more money. So, yeah. I mean, it's just a bunch of fake shit. More it's money, fake. more problems. It's <laughs> fake and it's fucking goofy as fuck. Girl, you're so right, Ryan. So, yeah, nobody cares, man. Absolutely nobody cares. So, um... You and John sorry, for the, sorry for the language, but I've been hearing this shit for the last hour and a half. I seen how proud he was last time he talked about. It. I mean, come on, bro. If you if you're ashamed of it, you sent your pictures of you the bruises to Neil. That should let everybody know what type of dude yeah, he is. Yeah, right there. It should be no fucking question. Right Cause you and know, I, you know Neil puts everything out. Neil you know can't I mean? hold water. So I mean, it is what it is, though. I mean, the money rules everything. But you guys, too, Brian and Aaron, when, when Neil is disgusted by it, I, I thought about that earlier. I kind of let it's not funny, but it's just so, it's strangely ironic and horrific. But when Neil is disgusted by what somebody did, it's like, wow, you know, he's like, I say a lot of shit and I'm not sticking up for Neil either. They're two disgusting bucks, but he seen Neil seems to be more like grossed out than, you know. It, it was it was just just a sad um, state um, of affairs. And I also want to point out when the first time Neil swatted him, he was him and Neil was supposed to swat another woman in the community, but somewhere their signals got crossed and Neil ended up swatting him. So let's not pretend he's a victim. So when you That's guys right. get this goofy shit, oh. it's really baffling. You know, I've been listening to this dude for a year. I've had him blocked for over a year. Over a year. So when you guys do this weird, goofy shit, I just, it, it just blows my fucking mind. This dude is a piece of trash. Yes, he has a lot of money, but he is trash. You know, maybe one of y'all should date him and see how it turns out. But thanks for the mic, Well, Don. I think uh, Gina, Gina. Thank you. So did I hear that right? That Gina Gina reached out to Justin. That's what he said about a business proposition. <laughs> wow. I just feel like I'm never surprised when it's Gina Gina, and it's weird to me when when people <laughs> right, are. Right. I, I. Yeah. <laughs> It's like you you're not you're surprised that you you are surprised. I, I I'd be surprised if she didn't do anything. Right? I mean, like when I hear like, well, of course she did. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Duh. <laughs> you know, I think to myself, but not that I'm the sharpest knife in the drawer with, you know, shit, you know, there's stuff I get wrong, but pretty much, you know, we're all good at this stuff. I love to see um, the DMs of people requesting. Me too. Um, Me too. I mean, that'd be a space on its by itself. Oh my goodness. Lanny, John, 
Kathy Barker. Uh, what about me? <laughs> <laughs> what I do now? 